The snowfall is here and folks are doing this. They're rushing to the grocery store, picking up the eggs, maybe a second pack, the milk, the bread, you name it. So what is the reason behind all of this? I went to the experts to find out why. I got the bread. I got the milk. <laughs> Definitely got the canned goods. Kenyana Frizzell. Those are snow flurries. <laughs> is like a lot of folks. Check out these lines. Everyone's trying to stock up before the snow hits. It definitely brings me out to stock up the cabinets to get prepared. But is there more to this than just being prepared? University Hospital psychologist Dr. Jeff Janata says yes. People have a tendency to want to take control of a situation that they fear, even if that fear is irrational. He says the fear of not having enough food or water during a snowstorm is not a reality 99% of the time. We've experienced plenty of them. The big snowstorm that might isolate you for days on end is just not very likely here. So therefore, try to make your appraisal realistic of what the threat really is. Dr. Janata encourages folks to be realistic in their appraisal of threats, saying the after effects of a snowstorm typically don't last long. The snowfall is here. There's nothing we can do about that. But what we do have control over is how we handle and deal with the stresses that come along with it. In Cleveland, Dominique Ricks, News 5.